let's uh, let's do something. How about we do a uh, very simple qigong exercise? We'll use a form that we've used for other energies, but now we're we're into the wood. We're into the liver. So liver is where it starts. Okay, we're going from water, which is very very yin, into liver, which is going from yin to yang. Okay, and this is where it starts. So the the energy of, of uh, the emotion of liver is anger. And this is tempered by the joy of the heart. Okay, the heart is joy and it is uh, uh, the fire energy is joy and the anger. So you get a joyful anger. So you get this, there's an intensity that comes with liver chi, with wood. So there's a, you know, mm. So in the, uh, for liver chi, for wood chi, it's in the fingernails and in the tendons and the ligaments in your connective tissue system. So what you want to think about is maybe like you've got some, some dragon claws there or some kind of claws and you're extending those and you're, you're grabbing with your fingernails, with your claws. So when you're making these motions, the, the hand is kind of rounded and, and you're reaching, you're really extending, okay, as we do this. So we're gonna do a very simple Qigong, uh, keeping it simple so it's not like you're memorizing a new movement, but you're finding this idea of breath and stillness in the motion. And we're gonna hang in the stillness for a little bit so you can really feel into that and, uh, and allow the chi to really uh, to, to build up, to mobilize. Okay, so, here we go. All right, so, begin with your feet. <sighs> and step out. Good, so you wanna get your three pillars. That is, you wanna feel the balls of your feet and allow your weight to settle over that. Bring your knees over the balls of the feet. Allow that to settle in. So you're feeling kind of like you're on the edge of a diving board. You're gonna dive off. You feel the crown of your head and reach up with the crown of your head, tuck in the chin and open up the gap between your, uh, your occiput and your neck, your jade pillow gate. You're opening that. Tuck in the chin. Relax your lower back and allow your tailbone to drop, your Wei Lu. Allow that to drop. When you do that, check again, make sure you didn't sink back into your heels when you, uh, whenever you dropped it. Reach with your fingers, your index fingers. Reach with your elbows, so don't let your arms collapse. You want to bring out the elbows slightly, opening the shoulders. So you're not lifting the arms, you're just reaching out and creating space in the shoulder joints. So just hang there for a second and just feel into that. And notice how quickly you move into the gap between thoughts. As your body mind shifts into a body-mind-spirit integration and you go into a superconscious state. Okay, so we're gonna be doing some wood chi. So wood chi is expansive. As you're feeling those fingernails Feeling the, the sinews, the tendons and ligaments. Feel into your hands and notice the chi that's already building up there. As we begin in stillness. Take your right hand and circle to the right. So 
circle back the hand under the dantian, under the, under the navel. Feel that. Feel the stillness there. Now bring your hand up, palm in, bring it up your center line. And this is a yang extension. So here I'd like you to breathe in as you reach up. Inhale through the nose. When you get up here, you're going to rotate the forearm so the palm faces up and reaches up. You're really extending, opening, reaching with the elbow, reaching with the wrist, reaching with the fingers. And we've reached the end point of our yang extension. I just want you to feel into the stillness there. Now take your left hand and circle that out. You bring it under your navel, the dantian, reaching up with the right hand, pressing up. Feeling the left hand and feel those two poles in opposition. And feel into that still point. We're creating, we're generating, we're, we're creating energy here. We're tapping into the big chi, but we're also creating localized energy between our hands as we Feel that stillness, those poles in opposition, generating, mobilizing the chi. So now the left hand comes up the center line, the right hand comes down. Rotate the left forearm so the palm reaches up, right hand, palm down, sink. Bend your knees, sink a little bit as you reach up and reach down and pause and feel the stillness there. So notice we had uh, the left hand was going up there, which is yang, the right hand was going down, which is yin. Turn. Circle your right hand, turn back. So actually turn out here and just feel that. So we're, before we turn back, here's another still point, okay? We reach the extension of, of how far we're gonna reach out with that right hand, we reach another still point. So feel into that, feel the, we got a, a rotational energy here that is also creating some cool stuff. But we're also reaching up with that left hand. So we, these poles in opposition create something unique. And then turn back and come to here, back to the center, reaching up, reaching down, poles in opposition. Breathe, feel in, feel into the stillness, feel the energy mobilizing. Inhale as your right hand comes up, left hand comes down. Rotate, right hand reaches up, left hand reaches down. Feel the stillness. Left hand circles out. Feel the stillness at that turnaround point. Feel the opposition between the two hands. All these things are happening simultaneously. In a super conscious state, you can keep track of them, even if your conscious mind can't. You're also feeling into the balls of your feet. You're feeling the turn of your body. You're reaching with your elbows, reaching with the crown of your head. All these things are happening simultaneously. And in a super conscious state, you can regulate those. 
without getting stuck in thinky thinky mode. And then turn back to center. Left hand comes up, right hand comes down. Feel into the stillness. Feel the extension. Feel the wood chi, the expansive yang chi that's animating your connective tissue system right now. Feel that whole body integration, the jung teaching, the whole body energetic connection. Bring your left hand down. And stand in stillness, feel into that. Feel the energy mobilizing, feel it circulating throughout the whole system. Feel the internal pressure So this is how we get used to having a whole bucket of chi. Because this can be uncomfortable if you're not, uh, if you don't practice it. Be able to learn to tolerate this much energy running through the system to be able to function with this much energy. And that's the purpose of Kung Fu. It's just practice and get used to it so that we can utilize it. Feel the ball of the right foot, set the right knee, spiral down to the left, sink into your right claw, and step in. Take a deep breath. And press down and disappear the chi. Dissolve into the emptiness, into the stillness.